We head to South Africa now, where the National Defense Force, SANDF, has received the remains of its soldier who died in Mozambique. The chief of the Defense Forces, Rudzani Mawaya, says the soldier's death was not in vain and that maintaining stability in Mozambique is vital for the protection of South Africa's territorial integrity. The life of the late Corporal Tebukhoha Dewe is not in vain. Our people are committed to continue to render the necessary service to our region as an extension of the protection of our own territorial integrity. Our commitment in eradicating the scourge of terrorism in Mozambique is equally the protection of the region and our respective countries. We will continue to give support to the people of Mozambique and the life of the late Corporal Tibu Kokadeve is the life that served that purpose to say, I will do anything to bring peace and stability in the region. And this life is not in vain. In the meantime, Democratic Alliance lawmaker Kabus Marias has questioned the air support and intelligence augmenting the South African National Defense Force troops deployed to Mozambique on an SADC mission. This comes after a soldier was killed by insurgents this week while waiting for air extraction. The lawmaker said the DA expresses its condolences to the loved ones of the disease while urging the government to make the region and country a safer place. He stated that the South African government must take full responsibility for the death of and injuries of the nation's soldiers. Marais added that the SADC must accept that it is taking on ISIL in Cabo Delgado and properly prepare and support the troops that are deployed.